Yes, finally, finally. <laughs> finally! <laughs> oh, well, my voice broke out for a second. We're back with another Dragon Ball Legend video. Of course, we got a lot of new stuff here. Uh, we got two new characters that got Zenkai. And last time I was out of it, I just did um, Mega Tanks Day download video for Gold and stuff like that. It is really hot where I am, though, so. Sorry about that. It's just, getting, it's just massively, massively hot. It's been crazy the last couple of days, though. But of course, we did get the new Spare Bomb Goku right here. He finally did just get his Zenkai and stuff like that, of course. So that's kind of cool and stuff like that, of course. Um, again, we already knew he was going to get his Zenkai. Um, I, think, I think he was already getting mine beforehand. Um, so I'm going to get really late to the video because I completely and utterly forgot about this guy getting his Zenkai. So I was like, oh, okay. I'll go ahead and just do a quick video for him. It doesn't really matter, though, but I do want to still get it out as I can because I completely and utterly forgot about it. And I was like, holy crap. The video's gonna be really outdated. Though. But of course, though, because um, I was focusing mainly on Goku's, like all the new Goku's that came out, I, the new completely dropped before this guy. Even Gohan, the future Gohan guy, Zenkai, that was now some V jump. Like, I forgot about that one too, and I was like, oh my lord. I'm falling way behind our legends. So, of course, we have that, and of course, we have, um, we can go on, get Gohan right here, getting his Zenkai as well. Um, again, that was a good future buff, you know, we needed it. Like, we barely needed another future buff after, like, this last couple months. But, yeah, uh, you can now get him from, of course, a free to play event or a uh, uh, Android event that has been updated. It's typical stuff, you know, revamped, updated. Typical stuff we already kind of know and got, though, so I don't really need to explain or go over that. Um, again, it's Trunks' old event. No, just again, I think the you know, I think originally you couldn't get the Gohan from that event, now you can. I'm um, getting ready, he's in Kai and stuff like that, of course, um, typical stuff. I mean, but if you're something that got him for like a really long time, you should have him. But extreme type C is an extreme unit though, so, um, or EX unit, so, yeah, yeah, they're not that easy to get, trust me, they really aren't. Um, like, I'm one more away from, like, Zenkai Krillin, I don't even have enough for him, so, so, yeah, I just need one more, I'm like, hoping on the banner, is like, oh, okay, I'll wait till the next banner to get him, or, like, all these daily discounts I can do every single day. That's great! Yeah, but of course, um, look at his event has been be it has been brought back, revamped, so you can go ahead and get him and stuff like that now. But again, I think I have him at three star, I believe. So yeah, again, that's how it's tough. It is just to pull his Zenkai unit regularly, though. So yeah, of course, that's gonna break these units down, go over them because I completely, again, completely, utterly forgot about him. I was gonna go Goku first, but I was like, you know what? I'll go Gohan then Goku. I now I regret. I want to go Goku first and Gohan, but. So it doesn't really matter though, of course. So yeah, against EX units, they don't really change that much of them. I think they kind of do. I know it's been a really long time. But yeah, then I looked down the DBZ dot space for on but I was like, I don't see the Zenkai thing because I always have a. They always kind of have like a Zenkai kind of like monitor in the in the um. They always have like kind of like a Zenkai like you know stamp right there next to that unit. But this one, Gohan didn't have one, but Goku did. It was weird. But I guess I'm not like okay to get though. At times recording, they probably already have it out of there. So yeah, time to go down for Gohan. He does, of course, main ability restores um ally health by 20%, 25% to damage inflicted for 25 timer counts. Uh, requires 20 timer counts must be executed. Um, his unique ability um applies the following effects to sell from the character into the battlefield: 20% to damage inflicted for 20 timer counts reduces um. Reduces damage received by 15 timer counts for 20 timer counts. Additional 40% to dip to blast inflicted when character um, with character trunks. Um, we have a um, character named Trunks is on the battlefield. Um, effects reset after character switch. So again, but it's kind of like Future Gohan and Doku where you need that guy to transform. The, um, you need Trunks. So yeah, that that guy from the future. That that super guy from the future thing. Um, yeah, he um, basically you need like a Trunks to transform in Doku, but um, def like any type of like Future Trunks. Um, so, go on, get your form of Super Saiyan. Um, it's kind of the same thing here a little bit, though. Um, again, Doku and Legends always kind of copy each other. Um, not in characters, more like events and celebrations. And mainly kind of characters, though, but... Or they switch back and forth, either one. I mean, because, you know, Legends has adventures, Doku and Din, and now they got pits on battle, so, yeah. Uh, let's, um, reset after character switch. Um, cover... So, the Tujin counts, um, damage cut. Um, reduces received damage by 20%. It reduces, yeah, damage received for 40% until combo ends when change, cover changing. Plus two to own substitution cut when activated. Um, plus the following effects, of course, itself. Um, after um, the character, um, after the enemy attack is over. Um, this had to get them to the next level and stuff like that, of course. Um, increases, um, this is always the kind of units that always kind of explain and break it down right here. Increases, um, alts card on draw speed level by one for 20 timer counts. Um, 40% to own key for key recovery for 20 timer counts. Because that after that is basically um, his last level right here, powerful. A positive falling effects to sell from the character entered the battlefield. Um, restores key by 30%, 40% damage to damage for 20 timer counts. So it seems like after like 20 or more timer counts, he gets a lot more damage. Um, 
or a character, whatever character switches, um, he'll, um, um, I guess with the trunk and stuff like that, he'll get stronger. Or when enemy, after enemy attacks, or just in general with timer counts, or mainly he does the buffing himself up a lot though, so yeah. It seems like it's gonna be like that. Blast Strike do anything, but now let's go ahead to his blue, um, card, of course, his special, and of course his green card. Um, ooh, I, ooh, I have a shrimp for a second. Uh, Oh, okay. Deals major impact damage, plus 15% to damage on the foot for 20 time accounts upon activation. Uh, 15 time accounts upon activation. Um, I'm not key form of life. Uh, I, 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 I'm getting like it's because uh, I got, um, I was so excited from um, doing all the other Goku's. But show his own health by, um, 10%, I, I, I don't know what's on me, um, 10%, um, and key up by 50, no, key up by 35%. Um, turn my power ability don't really think about that, so it's going to be something. So yeah, increases, of course, for his, um, main ability and stuff like that, of course. I actually meant to go to his main right here. I actually meant to go to his main right here. I like to kind of go all the way through. Um, increases the following, um, stats of characters that have a green and basic X, um, EX, 30% to base attack, um, base blast attack, 30% to base, um, blast, it, um, defense. And of course, he both feature attack by 35%. He hasn't seen that bad. He seems really simple and easy to go over with. Again, it, um, again, extreme units, again, do kind of need the help, because, no, they actually, they really don't, but, again, that and any extra green unit character can be really good, especially EXs and stuff like that, which have gotten better over time, actually. It's just harder to pull them, though, so you never kind of get really see it. It's gonna be kind of like base form Gojira, you for guys, like, kind of. Kind of same. So it seems like he has to, um, extinguish or just go through a lot of time accounts to be really good, but, yeah, it seems like just kind of that though. There's a lot of timer counts, switching, having good chunks on the team, starting his own health up a lot, and just increase like his damage output. It's gonna take a long time, but I feel like it's gonna be actually really, really good for like damage and stuff like that, of course, in my opinion though. Um, I'm just saying that in my opinion though, it's just um really gonna be really crazy, I guess, with this guy going around and stuff like that. But um it doesn't seem to be that bad, that bad though. Again, there's gonna be a lot of timer counts, a lot of just you gotta execute a lot of timer counts just to get him through all this. But I feel like overall EXT is going to be a really good unit as time goes on the more and more and more. Especially when you battle with stuff like that, it won't be as bad, but it'll be pretty solid, I guess, in my opinion. Oh no, again, you have, you have to have a lot of time accounts for me. Um, it's just like my whole, my whole opinion. A lot of time accounts, but he'll honestly, again, like, be good at the battle goes on with stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, yeah, again, a lot of time accounts. I'm going to keep saying that now. Um, for him to be good, you know, which, he does get back his lot his key. He can be good with the trunks on the team, so, yeah. He literally seems like it features Gohan from Doken, kind of. Same kind of thing, but yeah, he doesn't just change things. Now on to base form of Goku right here. This guy has been a long time coming, long time in the game. Again, this thing has been, it should have been in the game, like, day one. But, I mean, it's good to do it now and wait, because he actually would be probably kind of dead right now if he was the first ever used to ever get a Zenkai in the game, specifically, in my opinion. But, hey, whatever. Um, of course, though, I'm now down to the info and stuff like that, of course. Um, so he does his last health, uh, main, um, ability. I said main memory. I, I know what it was. Um, 30% to damage inflicted for, oh, my throat is killing me. <clears throat> Give me a second. Sorry, these legends pass this going really, really long. Um, 30% to, um, damage inflicted for 20 time accounts. And inflicts enemy with attribute downgrade plus 40% to, to blast, um, received for, um, for 25 timer accounts. Um, requires 15 timer accounts must be executed. Um, his unique ability though, uh, of course, for a team, for two allies, um, inflicted damage of a positive positive effects to self when, uh, to self where, while there is three more battle members remaining. So he's left up to death unit. The Super Saiyan 4 Goku. The more battle members you have or don't have, the stronger he gets. 30% damage inflicted reduces, um, he reduces damage received by 25, by 20%. Um, sees the blah, 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 I forgot. <laughs> um, reduces overlord. Oh, uh, reduces um damage people perceive by twenty time or um, by twenty twenty percent until combo ends when changing. Plus following effects to self from battle a starting battle for a five time accounts. Thirty percent to damage inflicted. Um, the applies to be downgrades in animal conditions. Um, th that's impossible. Blah, blah. Um, that first ability, of course, the first time you get it, um, plus following effects to allies when the character is defeated, um, restores health by 10%, plus 20% to damage inflicted, to the bitter end, uh, to unlock it, to get that powerful, plus following effects to self when the character enters the battlefield, restores key up by 30% to, um, 10, to 10%, um, no, restores key by 30, plus 10% to damage inflicted, can I be stacked? Increases um cards draw speed, ca arts card draw speed level by one for 15 time accounts. 
Dragon Ball didn't do anything though, of course. But um, on the special move, Spirit Bomb, it does major damage, explosive, major explosive damage, applies the following effects to enemy on hit. Um, it flicks some attribute damage plus 20%, plus damage received for 50 damage counts, 30% to damage and um, inflict pain, to inflict um, faint. Um, he did that kind of before, but not the faint part, so uh, he might have, I think, but um, no, he has though. I think he did before because I used him for the freeze event to get um, my Ultra Goku. Uh, restores um, own key up by 45%, plus 20%. Percent damage of victim for third time account. Um, question I mean about ability, blah, 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 blah. so main ability though for Z is just blue and Frieza on um, Saga Z uh, or you know, episode Z. 20% um, the strike um, strike attack, 20% the damage blast, and 25% the strike defense, and 25% the damage defense. A blast defense. Um, his main ability does 25% to damage, does Saiyans on strike defense, because he is defensive during battle. So he's a mainly defensive unit. It seems like he's Gohan on crack a little bit though, but. Um, when get, but when you get that to Spirit Bomb, he can actually be really good with that. Faint actually can be really good. I guess like Gohan, you need a lot of timer counts to be good though, but um, of course, key again, that didn't happen before we did like his green card. It didn't restore his key up, but now it does. And that's actually gonna be really good. Faint on Spirit Bomb, they make this guy actually really good because again, now, you got, now that you got Zenkai, you can probably go back to the freeze up, man. And if you just still do not have Ultra Goku, you can possibly beat it now even more easier with this guy and like the blue pickle, but um, yeah, again, if you're struggling, struggling with that event or whatever, you know, you don't have enough, you can get this guy, probably good. But again, like, the other, every, every free plays that guy, it's probably going to be impossible to get him, though, but um, it seems like that he's kind of going on a little bit. But overall, as time goes on more, he'll do a little bit more damage. And yeah, as a sparking unit or whatever, he's going to mainly have, like, a lot. He's going he's gonna to be really good against Blast, like, Blast cards, because again, a lot of characters look to spam Blast. Or Strike, mainly kind of Blast, where every time I play, it's like three Blasts or three Strikes. He was like a Blast, Blast, and like a Strike, like a Strike. Um, most cards for me, that's how I've been doing it for Legends though, so yeah. But I can get video here, like I said, for, for sure though. But yeah, Goku seems like he's Gohan a little bit, but adding some extra buffs. And Gohan actually seems really good with the B of the time accounts and stuff like that, though, of course. So yeah, end of video here for sure though, so yeah. Um, see you guys later though, thanks for watching. Have a great day, great life. All who doesn't get though, for sure. Stay safe, watch your hands, God bless all of you that we go out, put it on a the toilet paper if you need to though. I'm just kidding though, of course. So what do you guys think about the Gohan and um, Goku? Do you like him? Do you hate them? I think they're both really good. Again, as Gohan, as he gets more time accounts less, um, he'll do a lot of good damage. He'll be really good when the battle goes on. And Goku will have a little bit of life after death, which makes sense because, you know, this is after, you know, goes Super Saiyan, fights, you know, Frieza after killing Squirrel, so it makes sense he had to life after death, um, you know, penalty slash ability. And it seems like he's going to be a little bit more better than Gohan as time goes on. I feel like he might out even out damage Gohan later, but, yeah, though. Or both really good. So yeah, see you guys later though again. Nope. So.